Regardless, if you look at the RNC, we had a very strong, at my suggestion, and I gave Ryan's great credit for this, at my suggestion, because I know something about this world, I said I want a very strong defensive mechanism. I don't want to be hacked. And we did that. And you have seen that they tried to hack us and they failed. So I know when you're telling the truth or when you're not. I just see many, many untruths full thing. Tell you what else I see, I see tone. You know the word tone? The tone is such hatred. I'm really not a bad person, by the way. No, but the tone is such... I do get good ratings, you have to admit that. The tone is such hatred. The panel is almost exclusive anti-Trump. And the hatred and venom coming from his mouth. The hatred coming from other people on your network. Now, I will say this. Uh, I watch it. I see it. I'm amazed by it. I'm having a good time. Tomorrow they will say, Donald Trump rants and raves at the press. I'm not ranting and raving. I'm just telling you, you're dishonest people. But, but, I'm not ranting and raving. I love this. I'm having a good time doing it. But tomorrow the headlines are going to be, Donald Trump rants and raves. Uh, I'm not ranting and raving. Go ahead. Story after story after story is bad. I won. I won. And the other thing, chaos. There's zero chaos. We are running. This is a fine-tuned machine. We had Hillary Clinton try and do a reset. We had Hillary Clinton give Russia 20% of the uranium in our country. You know what uranium is, right? It's a thing called nuclear weapons and other things, like lots of things are done with uranium. Doing some bad things. <gasps> Nobody talks about that. I didn't do anything for Russia. I've done nothing for Russia. And I can tell you, speaking for myself, I own nothing in Russia. Mm. I have no loans in Russia. I don't have any deals in Russia. Mm. President Putin called me up very nicely to congratulate me on the win of the election. He then called me up extremely nicely to congratulate me on the inauguration, which was terrific. Mm. I love to negotiate things. I do it really well and all that stuff. But, but it's possible I won't be able to get along with Putin. Maybe it is. But I want to just tell you, the false reporting by the media, by you people, the false, horrible, fake, fake reporting makes it much harder. So I don't have to tell you. I don't want to be one of these guys who say, yes, here's what we're going to do. I don't have to do that. I don't have to tell you what I'm going to do in North Korea. Wait a minute. I don't have to tell you what I'm going to do in North Korea. And I don't have to tell you what I'm going to do with Iran. You know why? Because they shouldn't know. And eventually you guys are going to get tired of asking that question. So when you guys ask me what I'm going to do with the ship, the Russian ship as an example, I'm not going to tell you. But hopefully I won't have to do anything. But I'm not going to tell you. Okay. Uh, um, um, Where are you from? Uh, BBC. Okay, here's another beauty. <gasps> it's a good line. Impartial, mm. free and fair. Yeah, sure. Uh, Mr. President, Just like CNN, right? Uh, on the travel ban, uh, we could banter back and forth. On the travel ban, uh, would you accept that that was a good example of the smooth... <laughs> yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Let me tell you about the travel... Wait, wait, wait. I know who you are. Just wait. <laughs> Let me tell you about the travel ban. We had a very smooth rollout of the travel ban, but we had a bad court. You see, he said he was going to ask a very simple, easy question, and it's not. It's not. Not a, not a simple question, not a fair question. Okay, sit down. I understand the rest of your question. So here's the story, folks. Uh, number one, I am the least anti-Semitic person you've ever seen in your entire life. Hmm. Number two. Racism. The least racist person. In fact, we did very well relative to other people running as a Republican. Quiet, quiet, quiet! See, he lied about... He was gonna get up and ask a very straight, simple question. You know, welcome to the world of the media.